What's up guys, Fraser here for Complex News. Bryn Cameron, Blake Griffin's ex-fiance and the mother of his children, has filed a palimony lawsuit against the NBA star, according to TMZ. The lawsuit alleges that Griffin told Cameron to quit her work, an interior design business and sports marketing job, because he would financially support her. Cameron says Griffin had reneged on his promise after he began dating Kendall Jenner. While Griffin is continuing to earn millions from his NBA and endorsement deals, Cameron and their children are homeless and cash-strapped. In Griffin's absence, Cameron's brothers had to provide Cameron and the children with financial support. The former couple had been together for eight years on and off before the split. They have a daughter and son together. The couple's end came just a week before they were set to be married and was reportedly precipitated by Cameron's refusal to sign a prenuptial agreement. She claimed she refused to sign it because of a pact the two made back in 2013. Cameron's lawsuit also took the time to connect Griffin's recent trade to the Detroit Pistons to the former couple's relationship. Griffin himself, however, knows very well what breaching promises is all about. After all, Griffin had no problem trading Bryn Cameron, his former fiance, and the mother of his two children for reality television star Kendall Jenner. In addition to all of that, Cameron points out that she helped Griffin through a rough patch in his career that came about because of his rocky relationship with ex-teammate Chris Paul, as the two supposedly battled it out for control of the locker room. Cameron strengthened Griffin's bond with his teammates and allowed the organization to see a different side of his personality, rather than the hard-partying man-child Griffin had been prior to their cohabitation. Despite not naming a specific amount of money in the legal documents, TMZ guesses Cameron wants a sum that's in the seven-figure range. That's news for now, but for more stories like this one, subscribe to Complex News on YouTube. For Complex News, I'm Frazier.